India stands at a very critical juncture in addressing its food market as it is on the cusp of implementing a front of package labeling policy. There are two core elements of our FOPL policy. One is having scientifically mandated cutoffs for salt, sugar and saturated fat and the other one is to have an effective label design. The study commissioned by Nutrition Alchemy just used 1300 samples that were handpicked and it found that nearly 98% of these samples would not meet the CRO WHO cutoffs. So what are these WHO CRO cutoffs? These cutoffs are, are ones that have been developed by WHO in the Southeast Asia region using the Indian food market in mind to come up with cutoffs for salt, sugar and saturated fat. At the same time, another study commissioned by Ames as well as UNC Chapel Hill, headed by Dr. Chandrakant Pandav, has found that only 68% of Indian foods from a sample size of over 10,000 randomly selected samples will actually not meet the WHO CRO cutoff. So what we're finding that countries around the world like a Brazil, a Chile, an Argentina, they are all using the WHO mandated NPM model, finding it to be both practicable and scientifically valid. So I, it is critical that India also tries to stick as closely as possible to the CRO model, which has been validated by the study conducted by Dr. Pandav and the UNC Chapel Hill Institute to really show that this is a practical study that is grounded in the reality of the Indian food market.